today I'm going to speak about thermistors so here are some thermistors I have a few in my hands so let's first discuss what a thermistor is a thermistor is a type of resistor whose resistance is not fixed it's it is dependent upon the temperature here you can see So these thermistors look like just a capacitor. For reference, I have some other capacitors. These are capacitors. Doesn't these two look so similar? Just there is a color difference. So first, let's take the transistor tester. I'll keep it here. lighting problem so i'll check the value of this so when i test it it's showing me 8.99 ohms it's a resistor so i'll first tell you what the thermistor is so as it as you heard uh, this has a resistance which is not fixed it all the time changes as the temperature cha difference due to the temperature difference so uh, i'll show you i'll uh, first let me speak about where this thermistors are used thermistor thermistors are used mainly in power supplies or with any uh, device which has a large capacitor in it in the input side so i have an smps circuit over here this is an smps circuit i have removed all the output cables that's why it's like this so here is the circuit the main power supply which comes out comes from this side is passed through this cable is broken this is the live wire and this is the neutral wire live goes in through the uh, fuse and then to some capacitors and then to the full bridge rectifier after that it comes into this black hope you can see this this black thing this is the black thing which is a thyristor so it's used in devices with cap which have large capacitors these are the capacitors in the input side that's the most important point just large capacitors in the input side so uh now i'll show you what this does so in circuits ha having the uh, large capacitors in the input side they will have an in rush current which is a very high uh, rush current so if we draw a graph like this for the in rush current the main the current required by the device might be of this level but when we start the device or just plug in plug into the source then this could show a like this a it's not like this it's a just like a sharp point like this it will just go, shoot up and then may have a small shoot up also after that come to the normal point and do if we have some current protection circuit or over current uh, limiters like that circuits then the these circuits would be triggered so your circuit might, might not work so to limit this in rush current we'll add a resistor in series i'll show you this
so to limit that we will add an resistor in series with the uh, circuit so here the is the circuit and here is the input this side this may be of less than 10 ohm so 0 to 10 ohm it's mostly like that values only not more than 10 ohm so this is the main circuit we use but if we do like this we have a problem if we just add a uh, resistor in series like this the resistor would get heated up as the circuit draws current so the resistor might burn out and it would cause a loss of energy according to the input so we we should we we need to use a thermistor here as when current is flowing at, at first second this might have 10 ohm so the starting this high i'll draw it down in a percent high inrush current of the peaks are cancelled over here and as the circuit draws in current more current then this would get heated up and its resistance would nearly drop to 0.1 ohm can't write here 1 0.1 ohm and thus it would decrease the loss of energy and it's a very good uh, component as it could increase the life of your device these are the main things about thyristors i don't have anything to heat this up this power supply okay i'll show you so here i have a transistor tester and i am going to plug in this so when i plug in this it's showing me 9.32 ohm showing me 9.32 ohm value so i have a 12 volt battery here lithium ion so i'll just hold it in like this getting warm and hold it with the it's very hot now and as it is hot i will plug it in and now let's measure the value it's 5.3 ohm you can see it's 5.3 ohm before it was heated it was 9 point something value and now it's 5 ohm that's what i was speaking about its resistance would drop its resistance cannot be 0 ohm but it will be very close to 0 ohm thus minimizing the losage and also protecting your device but this device has one un un problem also means you are using this or oh, just same diagram i'll draw once more so circuit here so as i can i will continue now my father disturbed me okay now in so when you are using this device for a for example 10 minutes and its resistance drops from uh, resistance drops from 10 ohm to let's take 1 ohm after that if we off the switch and then on it again immediately at that time the inrush current would again have a spike 
that's why many of the many electricians tell you not to on off your switch very fast means if you switch on switch off switch on switch off like that very fast your device might get damaged due to the spike the spike means i'll tell you so if you are using uh, let's take a voltage of 220 volt 220 volt over here which is ac and when this circuit creates a spike like this the spike peak voltage might be of 350 to 400 volt this spike could damage your device so i hope you understood i mean something about this tire resistors if you have any doubt about this then you could contact me through instagram or through the comment section of the video uh, i'll put my instagram link in the description so thank you for watching please like my video and share it if you found it in informative